If there was a way to make your music go viral and get your monthly listeners to 2x, 10x or 100x overnight, would you do it? If there was a way to all but guarantee that no matter what song you release, you would make money from, would you do it? If you could compress a decade of developing artists and managers into weeks, would you do it? If so, this is the masterclass for you. And using the Bouncer Hub infrastructure, I will outline in a second that this is every artist manager's dream to learn the business side of music. My name is Bouncer. My first artist I worked with, I got him signed for over one million dollars in the space of nine months. I got him brought out in the O2 arena by Drake and him being the first ever drill song, Air Force getting charted a top 20 independently in the UK official charts. Let's say we made history. Now time for the horror stories. After getting my artist signed for over $1 million, I didn't do any management agreement. I didn't understand the business side of music. I lost over hundreds of thousands of dollars because my artists decided not to pay me. That's my fault. I had to learn as I went on. After that, I started studying the business side of the music and I, I started asking myself, how do we make music a business? How do I build a residual income? How is the labels making billions every single year from our music? My second project, I made over $200,000 from only seven songs learning the business side of music without making a single song. I learned how record labels make billions of dollars every single year from your music. I paid real money to make over $200,000. In fact, I had to invest around $30,000. If I didn't invest in myself, I wouldn't be in the position that I am right now. The Bouncer Hub community that currently has over 1.7 thousand members before launch has life changing values that allows me to teach the business side of music, live webinars, over 50 modules breaking down the areas of music that you don't know. A 90 day, 12 week guide to become a music artist or a music manager, Be and management templates that cost thousands of dollars in the real world, but you get for absolutely free. Now guys, I am here to prevent horror stories. I'm here to two to a hundred times your monthly listeners, and I'm here to teach you the business side, focusing on artist development and marketing inside the music industry. Let's get into this masterclass. I want you to understand that every single artist around the world needs to be inside the Bouncer Hub community, learning and understanding the business side of music so you can launch your own record labels, your own management service, and so you as an artist can manage yourself. Now, guys, it's very important having labels, industry leaders inside my community every week, weekly webinars, once a month receiving webinars from a, what should I say, an A-list, a celebrity artist, so you can understand their journey. I ramped everything under one infrastructure so you guys around the world can connect with each other. You can ask for the right engineers to mix and master your music producers and collab and do features with other artists that's in on the same infrastructure level as yourself. Now, last week, Sunday, we hosted our very first music seminar, which was a success. We had two sessions and we had over 400 artists attend with management. And inside that session, someone won a 10,000 distribution deal to work alongside with me and my team. And that came from the Bouncer Hub community. Now, let me get into the Bouncer Hub community. The Bouncer Hub community is here. You can see a little bit of information. We're on the school infrastructure. We've got 1.7 thousand members. People are loving the community. 
obviously you can see at the top you can write something um and how the bouncer hub works so if i click on how the bouncer hub works there's some information and it just kind of shows you what the community tab does what the classroom tab does just for if you're a member and you don't know how the bouncer hub works you can also just see more and you can now follow steps also it has a whatsapp number that you can message a member of the team for any help you can also email obviously support at thebouncerhub.com it has a leaderboard etc i'll go through it but to show you guys and then also it has the member of the team and it has artists managers so forth of what to come what's to come so grateful for being in this space let's go i'm ready yes sir amazing day yesterday etc etc now you guys can also obviously write your thoughts put snippets of your music as you can see um, and by doing so you go to write something put a title for example um it's r b coming back and then obviously explain then you can select your category as you can see q a general discussion announcements artists management producers engineers and other now guys if you enter the classroom section this is where the value is and this is where life-changing opportunity learning the business side of music and making sure that you are in the best um position and you understand that no one will, will never burn you if you're having meetings with labels you're having meetings with fellow managers that's been in the game you understand what to answer for you you know what questions to answer and so forth now look how to become a, how to become an independent artist manager etc look if you look at this it says record labels distribution if i was to play this now briefly you will see because a lot of you artists are releasing music through an independent distribution. Now, guys, I break down from this masterclass. I will give you, tell you the difference between what a label distribution is, what independent distribution is, and what a record label is. So, for example, a record label usually goes through the splits of 80-20 in their in their favor. That means if you were to sign, they were to sign you for a million dollars, you would have to make five million dollars before you come out your deal and then for the next 10 15 20 years every million dollars that gets made you will receive two hundred thousand dollars and they will receive eight hundred thousand now distribution is the other way around where they you own your own masters um they will front up the money whether it's like i said a million dollars that means obviously they will recoup their money first and then you would receive eight hundred thousand dollars, and they would receive two hundred thousand dollars for two or three years. So it's a bit different. Now there's tabs here where it says radio plug, radio um, press release. I break down that management, beat publishing, music delivery. So where a lot of people's like, how do I deliver my music? Or what should I do? What's the correct way? There's a lot of people will say, oh, make sure you put your music in the system over four weeks, three weeks, so you can pitch, pitch it to the playlist. Do you know what I mean? So we have all these errors here, agreements, music lawyer, marketing, social media rollout, events, brands. Guys, if you look at all this value, if I tell you to take this in as a music artist, you will know the business side of music. And that is just one tab here. Now, if you go to Music Lights, or if you go to, there's a 90 day guide, yeah? 12 week guide to become a music artist. I know you are a music artist, but a lot of people don't actually don't know the structure of what they need to do. Now guys, look, I've broke this down into 12 weeks. So week one, if you stay into the hub, follow these steps and complete all these steps. Now, if I go back to classroom, let's go to management guide. I've done the exact same thing to become a management. I've explained the infrastructure, what you need to become a manager, what you need to look for artists, and what what week one, week two, week, week three, week four, and so forth. So, bouncer will be 
doing podcasts in the next couple of weeks. So there will be updates for podcasts. You guys can take in the podcast, get in gems, the masterclass. Obviously, guys, that is for the weekly webinars. Every single week, you get masterclass, weekly webinars, etc. And then, obviously, you've got YouTube gems that I add that what I see on YouTube so you guys can take it in, which is always updated um, weekly. There's always new updates. And then you have, obviously, executive package packages to work with me closely on a one-to-one basis. And you've also got some real inside info with me and my music lawyer, the same music lawyer that got uh, my artist signed for over a million dollars. There's breakdowns of publishing. If I go to publishing, there's breakdowns of graphic designs. Um, if you can see the infrastructure, major labels, copyright, Guys, this is the guide that if you watch all this and you understand the business side of music, you can't go wrong. Now look, in 38 minutes, I've got an inner circle. I've got an inner circle with my team Zoom call. So let's go to calendar now. Now guys, as you can see, it's the, it's the 12th. I'm about to start a a Zoom call with my team in, in in 39 minutes or whatnot. If you see on Sundays, every Sunday you got VIP artists, so all the artists that's on a monthly subscription, they join, we teach them the marketing, we teach them the business side, we get guests up, we get people from the labels, we get a &Rs, we get we make an opportunity that you guys that don't have be able to be heard and ask the right questions. And as... We get busier and busier. This will be updated more in the calendar and there'll be more opportunities for up and coming producers, engineers, artists, managers, and there'll be tabs. Now, let's go to the leaderboard. Like I said, as the leaderboard, as we add more and more levels, there'll be more opportunities for where people can get subscriptions. There could be ways that people can get um, a way to come out um, and get a one-to-one -one session with me. Bouncer, there'll be ways of people can potentially come to Dubai with myself. And you can see the leaderboards. You can see all the people that has been um, active inside the community. So I would always say be active inside the community um, and level up. Level up. Now, about yourself. This is just about myself. Obviously, I've worked alongside a lot of artists, um, obviously I've got my artists dig that trying a top 20 we made history and it's just some information um, obviously my community is $99 a month now here's my thing guys a lot of people waste $99 a day on weed they spend $99 on junk and then people that want to know the business side for me every artist that wants to be involved, that wants to learn the business side and wants to monetize and wants to connect to music, they need to be inside this community. They want to be, they want to be inside this community. And let me tell you why. Now, this here is my YouTube. If you head to the Bounce or YouTube, you can um, see how I made over $200,000 from seven songs without making a song. Now, guys, if you're on my landing page, just scroll down to the bottom and watch it yourself. But this is the stuff that I teach you guys. And this is learning the business side of music, guys. And also, if you look at the other areas here, he said, there's another thing. Yo, my people. You get me? Booking agents, live events, breakdown. You get me? Um, this is what you need to know. Look, guys, look. I'm, not, I'm just here. I'm not, I don't delete messages. It's just... People just saying gems and gems and dropping value. So um, this is what we teach inside our community. Now, let's go into a few facts. Let's go into a few facts, my people. Let's go into, for example, dig that. Let's go into dig that. Oh, it's not. It's not. Oh, they write it properly. 
But let's go to dig that. So you see in Dig That's career, I'm gonna talk about two songs. There was a song called Tactics. Now guys, I want you to take this song in. The song is just around the car, a little bit of money and a tracksuit. Now you see this song here guys? We shot two music videos. We shot Air Force on a Monday. We shot Tactics on a Tuesday. The reason why we shot Tactics and we made it just so basic was to promote the Air Force, the single at the end of the song. Now in our head we were saying, let's get this to over 500,000 views and then we're gonna release Air Force. But let's play it. As you can see, play dirty. When we step round there, set piece, I swear me and bro did tactics. Creased up 20s and 10s in plastic, got them in thick elastics. I was, I was going to sleep on a blue mat, coming like I was just doing gymnastics. She was like, Diggs, how you do that? I'm young with a drip, not broke and average. But way back when I should have been home. I was just me and him, literally me and him. But if we go towards the end of this video, this video was only for marketing this song here. I don't want you to take this in and this is clean marketing. This is what I spoke about in my podcast when I done Dig That Story. Now, this is the song that changed our life. Taken, it's, the song's called Air Force. You're hot you with the biggest back. B, I'm not sure if them jeans fit you. Hey, yo, it's dotty on the beat. Hey, yo, it's dotty on the beat. Hey, yo, it's dotty. I see, Zar, you did a magic Visuals by Kalem. I was on the road trying to double up home. Now I want to see my P's just triple. Had to run a boy down in my Air Force piss. Can I got a crease in the middle? Are you sure this corn will fit this? Now, this song changed our life. If we go to Air Force... The whole point of that tactic song was to promote Air Force. Air Force is on 38 million views. It's a gold record. It sold over 400,000 records. It soon be a platinum record soon. And with this Air Force record, we was averaging over 100,000 views for over four months. So in my head, I thought it was the best time to... Um, Arts, Crepton Conan and K-Trap if they will do a remix. Six As you can see. Now, this song made history hey, as well. Take this in. I was on a roll trying to double up home. Now I want to see my piece just triple. Now, you need to understand, guys, we didn't know in the UK official charts that the original and the remix will count as one. So what happened is we charted a top 20 independent with no major record, with no major record label backing. Now, what that done to the drill scene is, I think that's the reason why you see a lot of these drill artists charting number one and where they are right now, because this song made so much history. Now, from... This is just talking about marketing, guys. It all started from promoting tactics. It's all, it all started from me having a free song marketing strategy. I always talk about free song marketing strategies. This is what we had. And we promoted tactics just to promote Air Force. That was the whole focus on tactics to promote Air Force. And then now I think that ended up obviously going on to being a platinum selling platinum selling um, artists. We go to Hardy Capio, Gluten Tug. This song's on 17 million views, but the streams, let's go to the streams. Let's go to the streams. 77 million streams. This song is a platinum record. 600,000 sells and it's probably even bigger now 
this turned platinum like two years ago. So you can call me a platinum selling manager, um, but you can call me, um, I've been involved in a lot of projects. Now, just get into another artist because I don't want to just talk about one artist. I've been making multiple artists um, go viral. I've been making multiple artists artists um, get millions of streams. Let's go to A9. A9 is probably... A9. Me and Young Kings TV. Young Kings TV is a blog page. We've got 3 million views. We've never done a music video. We released on social media. This is why I always say that TikTok is your number one hub. You need to release on, but we released on Instagram. And Young Kings Freestyle Episode 4 A9 has got 205k views. We've done a sample. Now, this is one of my artists. No big following. Now, if we if I fast forward it. Now, with A9, we developed him. We done freestyles. We done singles. Um, and we done the free song marketing strategy. How to grow. As you can see, HBK, I was involved in this. I was in the music video. I kind of directed this one, Gasoline. Um, and you can see they're all similar sort of views from art developing A9. Um, as you can see. Now, guys, if I go to A9 streams, he hasn't got a massive following on social media, but he has all of these tracks most of these tracks has millions of streams now guys when it comes to the method and the strategy this is where we need to be now a lot of artists i always say to artists oh you need to release on tiktok you need to release on tiktok you need to release on tiktok this is where you need to be blah 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 and a lot of artists is like oh i need to have a following etc etc and i'm saying you don't need to have a following obviously i'm showing you my page now I've got 331,000 um, followers and obviously I do reactions and I do consistent reactions, but I just wanted to experiment and ask artists, look, most of the artists that I kind of speak to, I ask them to send me their TikTok candle and they start saying, well, uh, I haven't really been posted on TikTok. Well, guys, TikTok is where you need to be. If you're not at posting on TikTok, you are doing something wrong. So I thought, let me experiment. I have made two pages and I thought, let me post um, consistently. So I went to Bouncer Daily. Bouncer Daily. And I thought, okay, let me click on Bouncer Daily now. Now guys, I have just under 3,000 followers on Bouncer Daily. One of my p pages with artists, some, some, some videos are doing 200,000 views. Someone's doing 267,000 views, 157,000 views. Some's doing 141. But this shows me that I'm posting consistently. And guess what? I've managed to build a page from no followers up to 3,000 followers just from posting consistently. And this is what shows you as an artist, guys, all you need to do is be consistent. Now, I thought, let me just make another page because a lot uh, a, a lot of you lot might think, oh, yeah, um, Oh, this is this is this don't make like this don't make sense like in terms of oh it's easy for bouncer to do it so I thought okay let me make a page called bouncer reacts now guys this page is on almost a thousand followers now guys this is on 115k views this was a day ago okay okay he's got the man them there now you got yeah, 21 awesome. people look now, I wanted to demonstrate to you guys that you don't need followers to end up on the For You page. TikTok is another place that you can end up on the For You page and you can put your music out just from releasing content, literally releasing content. And this is my thing, guys. If you're a music artist, we need to be posting on TikTok. Now, 
what I'm saying is I want you guys to focus on the business side of music. So with me, we have strategies that we put on Instagram as well. We put meta ads on. Um, we have a system where we spend around $1,000 and it gets us up to 800,000 streams depending on the song. But we make profit from strategies like that. So what we do, as soon as we make our money, we keep on pumping money into the strategies. This is what the labels do. Guys, you get me? So once you understand the business side of the music, once you have a strategy and always focus, focus on the free song strategy. Now going on to, I like to go to WhatsApp before. Right, let me just go to WhatsApp, show you guys a few bits and that. Now my man, Simba, he messaged me and he said, oh, I thought I mentioned um, I applied your posting method on TikTok. I came across UK rap numbers, algorithms, and they posted me on their Instagram page. So I just told them to sh show me. So, so boom, this you was go. on the day of the seminar. Um, when we when we left, I was with my boys, we were in a car, they played my music, I was vibing to it and whatnot. Then I thought, let me just post it on here, just because it's something musical. And I posted them one hour after each other. So I posted this at three, or for example, three, four, five, and then 6 p.m. And then, you know, people commented saying, yo, what song is this? The song is good and whatnot. UK rap numbers liked it. They downloaded it, I think, from the TikTok. And then they, where is it, where is it, where is it? Give me a moment. If we look we at go, this yeah, now, my yeah. people. It posted me here. You can see it here, like, they're here talking about, they want to see the joint, all this and whatnot. Now look at this, my people. And then, um, what's it called? I even messaged them afterwards, told them, listen, like, you know, obviously I'm part of your your membership thing with, with the hub that you got going on and X, Y, Z and that. And yeah. Now, guys, here's my thing, man. This is what we teach in our monthly subscription. And I was saying $99 a month. And I looked online, I look at music courses and they cost around fifteen to $20,000 just to learn things that you're not gonna apply. And I thought, you know what, to make it feasible, um, to build up a whole ecosystem connection for you guys and and to learn and be a part of webinars, um, to work alongside myself, my team, I thought, you know what, this is what makes sense. You know what I'm trying to say? So going back onto this side of things and going back to the classroom section, because I think it's really important, and just going on to becoming an independent manager, um, I just wanted to like go through certain things. Look, there's there's loads of like even like pitching your music, guys. Yeah, it just it's just a little intro now, guys, block. Pitching your music and delivering your music. Look at this, guys. If you have so my thing is, guys. Look, we always rush when we're trying to put our music in the system, but if you set aside three songs and you strategize the three songs and you put them in the system from early, that means you'll be able to pitch your music and you have more time making content and releasing content. And this is what I focus on. And this is the importance of growing. Now, this is my thing, guys. No one's going to come up to you, especially record labels now. They want to see numbers. And my thing is getting you them numbers for record labels, independent places to give you the infrastructure and give you the funding that you need. But if you think that you're just making music and you're just gonna put it out there and you think that your music is enough for people to sign you, you've got another thing coming because people and labels are losing, people that work at the labels are losing their jobs because the labels are not making money. So that means that if artists are not develop, developing the way how they should be, or doing it themselves, no, they're not gonna come knocking. Now, my job is to make them come knock, knocking. But not only that, my job is to make you become a independent artist, make money from music and put your own money into music so you don't need to de depend on no one else. And this is what we specialize in. So look, click the link below inside the community, join the community. Um, I see you on the other side and I see you on these weekly webinars and let me, Let's be a part of something special. Um, can't wait for all artists around the world and managers and producers to connect with each other and go from there, man. But yeah, man, big shout out to everyone.